Here we go. So, so the movement we're demonstrating now is the bent over row. All right. So how we're going to be doing this is we're going to maintain a neutral spine after the entire movement to avoid any strain on the lower back. All right. The movement itself, we're going to stand with the feet width apart, the shoulder width apart, um, holding the broomstick or any other suitable object with an overhand grip. So now we're going to hinge up the hips, keeping the back straight. We're going to pull the broomstick towards the lower ribs, squeezing. And the shoulder blades together, then lower back down with control. All 
like the muscles you are activating is like the agonist, is the latissimus dorsi, the rhomboids, the posterior deltoids, the biceps brachii, the antagonist is the pectoralis, uh, pectoralis major, anterior deltoids, and triceps brachii. Alright, the joint and action that you've got of it is that the shoulder joint, the elbow joint, shoulder extension, as well as elbow flexion. So spotting areas during the movement over here is I will stay behind the movement and I'm just going to be watching and see how this form is and it needs to be spotting any way throughout the movement. Alright, and then for adapt adaptations for this move, we're going to adjust our grip width right along the bar. That's going to help us activate some more shoulders or some more back muscles, depending on the variation we take. It's so we're demonstrating the plank movement. Right, we moved over here. So, what we're going to be doing with the plank is we're going to keep the core engaged and avoid letting the hips stand or rise too high. So, the movement, we're going to start in a push up position with the hands down directly beneath the shoulders and body walking a straight down from head to heels. Hold this position. Focus on engaging the core and keeping the body stable. The muscles we're activating is the agonist, is the rectus abdominis, the transverse abdominis obliques, the rectus pinae, the antagonist muscle is our trapezius and our rhomboids. The joint and action that we've got over here is at the shoulder joint, the elbow joint, isometric contraction of the core muscles. Alright, so for spotting areas, I'm going to step aside, room over here, ready to provide cues for maintaining proper alignment or affecting the spot if that need any, any help in the position and the movement. And that's it. Alright then, adaptations for this movement is performing the plank direction such as the side plank, right, or with knee taps can add variety and challenge different muscle 